What's going on guys? Greg with North Coast Baseball Cards and today we have a real quick video. We're going to be opening up a blaster box, a top stadium club. I have two here, but I am going to be putting, let's see, put this one off to the side. This will be one of the prizes when we do hit 200 subs. Um, thanks everyone for making a video. If you do submit, if you submitted one today or um, plan on doing it, please do not. Uh, the giveaway is closed, and I do not think it's fair for everyone else if it's submitted beyond the deadline. We will run that giveaway early next week, but let's get into it. Um, real quick, though, uh, I was actually at Walmart today, and they were stocking. So that's how I was able to get two of these boxes. There's actually only one other guy there, and so I was able to also get two of these prism blaster boxes i'm not going to open them i'm going to use i'll probably sell them to offset some of the costs of opening cards um, but it was a really cool situation um, there was a couple little kids there that showed up while we were kind of waiting while they were stalking and the other guy was cool with it and we let them go first and <laughs> of course they only wanted pokemon but you know i thought it was the right thing to do and I got to talk to the vendor for a while as well, and he <laughs> he had some interesting stories of what was going on lately. He said that at another town near me, um, they were actually taking photos of him and distributing it around. I guess there's some <laughs> retail uh, Kabul or something in my area. And so when he would show up at another location, other guys would have their phones out and ask, you know, show him a picture that they had him on his phone. So very weird, very odd. <laughs> but I guess nothing surprises me in the hobby these days. Um, but yeah, I was very happy to get my hands on. I love the photography on these. Let's see, we got everything. We got a, oh, we got a little MasterCard of uh, Mookie Betts. I remember these from back in the day. They're very cool. So let's get into the rip. Yeah, he was also telling me like in the past he, he's had his vehicle tracked. <laughs> so a little crazy situation. Also guys, uh, I was hoping to have my Bowman Sapphire boxes in by now, but for some reason FedEx has taken forever. Very cool. I love the artwork, Victor Robles. There's a cool Ryan Mountcastle. Got Tony Gonsolin. Backwards card of Luke Voigt. What is this? Virtual reality. I guess that's a new insert. Got a Max Freak. Not sure what I'm going to do with this box yet. I just picked it up from my LCS recently. I think I'm going to hang on to it for a while. You know, just kind of put it up on the shelf, and when my son gets older, we will open it. Hopefully, Jazz and Cabrian and some other rookies emerge. Alejandro Kirk, rookie. Alex Gordon. Elvis Andrews. A backwards die-cut card. Very cool. Die-cut Alec Baum. I wonder what these are. These are called triumphant so i haven't seen one of those yet I've, I've seen very limited open got a red parallel of brandon crawford jesus sanchez so i've never really pulled anything big out of stadium club before <laughs> but it's one of those things where i have to get a blaster box just to see the photography got glass now Who's this? Pete? Nico Horner. I think he's injured right now. Chris Bryant. This is the black parallel. And we got a very cool JD Martinez card. Hope everyone's having a good week this week. Um, very interested to see if anyone's going to the National. I think James from Elite Cards, one of my friends, is going to be going. So looking forward to seeing his video coming out about that and his experience. Chris Davis. Adam Wainwright. The Ageless Wonder. Devin Williams. Backwards card. That's a red parallel. Josh Donaldson. He is a sports card collector as well. So 
one of these days I plan on going to the National. I know it's going to be closer to me next year. I think it's going to be in Las Vegas. Marco Gonzalez. Luan Diaz. Willie Castro. And then this is... Oh, throwback Ricky Henderson. I believe this is 97. Not sure what year that is, but it's close around that time. All right, three more packs. We got Shane McClannan, Gavin Lux, Corey Kluber, backwards Brandon Nimmo. It's a red parallel and a Brandon Nimmo. Brandon McKay, very cool Tatis card. We'll put that in the good pile. And then we got a Chrome card. It is Jake Cronenworth, very nice. He's having a great year. <laughs> so is this guy. And that is a sepia of Shohei Otani. This is a very good box. And a Nick Madrigal who's out for the year, but I was very high on him when he was there, when he was playing. So I'm liking this box so far. Last pack, Berrios, Tioscar, Yadi, a Paul de Young. This is probably the red parallel. Yep. And Gio Urshel. All right, guys. Like I said before, we'll be doing the giveaway next week. Um, I will try to get, I'm going to make a list of everyone who made videos. Um, the Wave 1 T206 box, I think, should be here tomorrow. So we'll be able to ship that out once the giveaway runs. And anyways, guys, I appreciate you watching. Take care, and I'll catch you on the next one.